Hello, uh, very quick Twitty Outdoors video. Here I am in my uh, very messy back garden. I'm going to uh, do a very quick wine tasting. This is uh, Domaine Favely. They're quite a large producer in Burgundy. I see these guys a lot. Uh, they're Gevre Chamatin Vievin, old vines from 2019. Now, um, sorry about the uh, shaky camera there. I'm slamming the bottle of wine down on the table rocking a little tripod. Not long ago, I would have said, I thought 2019 was perhaps not quite ready yet for general drinking, but the uh, Harmon Geoffrey, if that's the, uh, pronounce that correctly, um, picked up from uh, Fortman Mason, turned out to be absolutely delightful. That was a 2019 Geoffrey Chamatin. Um, very, very drinkable now. Uh, where are we? April, 2023. So, um, you know, time has marched on, and um, you know, perhaps perhaps the 2019s are, you know, coming into their own now. So, uh, let's see where we are with this domain favely. getting a slightly plummy vibe from this. It's a kind of fruit that has a sort of um, slightly um, slightly dark, darker, slightly richer character than cherry, perhaps black cherry. It's very dry. Um, Bordering on savoury, quite savoury, hint of spice. And yet the um, the nose is quite fruity and pretty. Black, black cherries and plums. Yeah, I would say that's not as immediate of an instant success as, say, the um, Armand Geoffrey was, which um, was just delightful on the very first sip. Perhaps this needs more air. Perhaps it needs a bit more time to sort of acclimatise. Um, hmm. And a hint of spice or um, slight woodiness or something. Perhaps there is a, a slight bit of tan in there. Almost a tiny hint of smoke. It's, it's interesting, it's um, constantly evolving.